Hello everyone. Welcome to this SSC real time class. Okay. So let's today we will discuss basically what is a data wrangling in data model of SSE. That means SAP Antigrid Cloud. Okay. So let's start. Yeah, so this is uh, basically SSC uh, server. Okay, so let's we are uh, export the flat file. Okay, which we have it. Okay, so which is us Excel file. Okay, CSV format. So let's click on this and selecting a source of the file, flat file. And this is the data of a uh, flat file data. Okay, I'm just uh, going to extract. Okay, and click import. Okay, so I'm going to import that file. Okay, and I'm going to show you how basically use basically a data model, a data wrangling. Okay, so data wrangling basically a kind of data manipulations. Okay, we'll let you know once this will uh, export the data. Yeah, you can see. Okay, so you can see, okay, we have successfully uploaded this data. You can see, okay, this is a complete data. We have it, okay. And now let's see, we are going to discuss about a data wrangling, okay? So data wrangling basically is a feature of SSC, okay? Where you can have a features to data manipulate, okay? Whatever the data in your model, okay? You can manipulate it, okay? Based on your business requirement, okay? So let's here, we can have some, uh, okay, features. Let me, I'll show you what is a, basically in how to implement the data wrangling in your, uh, basically a flat file or your model here which we have extracted here so now you can see here you can have a city or we can have a state here okay so whatever you can see here so let's see here we have a city okay just right select this column right click or just select it okay and you can see here there is an option called okay you can click duplicate header row duplicate column delete column hide selection delete row so based on your requirement, you can do it. Okay. So now there is another option. You can see here. This is a basically let me select this one. You will see another option. Okay. A convert. Okay. Either you can convert in the lower case letter or upper case letter. So let's we will come into the create transform. Click on this. You can see we have a basically uh, these are the option comes under transform. Okay. First one is a can connect. Second one is split, third one is extract, fourth one is replace, and last that is change. So let's show you how it works basically the change. Click on change. See, it is okay. Change basically going to upper case. If you have a if you want a lower case, it will come at lower case. If you want some like title case, it would be title case. So depend upon your so all the data in your column okay, is going to upper case. So this is the basically a change basically. Okay, if you want to close this, you can do it. Okay, now again, you can select this city and select this one. Okay, and go for the create transform. Okay, now you can see we have a, a okay, another option. Okay, called replace. Okay, so if you want to replace anything, okay, let's see if you want to replace anything, you can see put the sale number city. Okay, I'm okay, matching the value. Okay, if any value if you want to match, okay, you would replace it, you can replace it. So you can put that value, okay, and it is going to replace it, okay. This is the one way of do it. Either you can, okay, this is the one way. Other way you can have a, you can see simply keep row delete, okay, so you can do it. So this is the basically work basically. Even if you simply you can replace with Ahmedabad, okay, Ahmedabad going to replace Mumbai, it's like this one. See, it is going to replace. So, <clears throat> sorry, see it is going to replace it, all Mumbai. So this is how basically works, okay, for replace. Similarly, okay, <coughs> sorry. So similarly, you can see we have another options as, as well. So let's show you another options, okay. Just I'm going to delete the Mumbai rules. Okay. Now you can see all we have it, okay. Now, let's see here. Okay, now. You can see another we have just select your a uh, city oh, okay let's see i'm selecting this city or something okay yeah we have uh, this a uh, customer okay let's select this one and okay now let's say uh, connect so basically what we'll do can connect okay 
it will basically two one or more column is going to concatenate by delimiter okay let's see here show you see you can see the customer name okay and other column which you want you can select here let's say i want ct or something so you can select here let's see ct okay so once selected the ct and you have to give the value some delimiter something okay so so once you give it okay it will separate column would be there okay where you can see uh, where is the uh, options okay let me show you something here customer see you can see here customer and ct both okay we haven't given the daily meter that's why it is a concatenate okay so this is you can see law how basically works your concatenates okay so basically one or more field you can have a can connect over a, a file or you can say this is a okay so see model okay similarly if you have a let's see if you this is the okay split options ne next one is a split if you want to split it okay you can see it, split it see it is asking delimiter if you give the comma delimiter it will go into separate column okay and repeat option basically how many columns you want repeat it let's say two separate two columns will be generated here you can see one or two okay so whatever how many like say i want one so one will be generated here okay if you give here like a comma so what will happen your separate like your customer name and city going to separate it so now i'm i, I am not given here comma if you give the comma it will two column will generated so this is a use of basically a split okay if you, okay now the another we can see here extract okay if you want to extract anything okay you can extract it let's see here okay you can choose okay like extract number okay which number okay your word or anything after first okay you can put here and from which column you want so basically that value or word is going to picked and put it into your separate column that is the meaning of a uh, extract so this is basically we have a, the feature of a data wrangling here apart from that we will have a multiple options you can see display and layout you can see we have a layout like this okay you depend upon your requirement you can see the layouts as well even display options are available all the column names you can see here okay even you can see if you want to some ascending descending some kind of okay error if you have any so it would be here even see some action like okay even we have some coordinate area name even okay so these are the options you can see we will discuss this hierarchy builder later okay this is a formula bar if you want to write some formula over your reports or something model you will just create here formula as well even we can have a combined data if you want to combine data you can combine it okay so depend transpose okay if you want to convert like from row to column column to row it could be possible here okay even you can see if you want to duplicate row okay if you want to remove the duplicate row if you have any duplicate in this okay it would just click here all would duplicate it here so as of now there is no duplicate that's why it's saying zero record has been deleted okay so there is no duplicate at all here so this is how okay the basically the data wrangling works on your model okay so if in case any questions okay any doubt okay please uh, comment okay if in case any okay uh, doubt write a mail to us okay and even definitely you should subscribe this channel as well okay so thanks thank you uh, very much to attending this session okay bye